Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing very, very well. In today's video, I am sharing with you the boys' bedroom Christmas makeover. I've been saying over and over again, probably sick of me saying it, that was transforming the boys' room into a bit of a grotto. It's got a bit of a candy theme. I have finished it and I'm really, really pleased with how it looks. I am just gonna show you the video of it from the start and then some of the things that I've done. And then at the end, I'll show you exactly what it looks like when it's all done. So yeah, I hope you love it. So this is the boys' room before I decorate. There is the Christmas bedding on already because they insisted on having that on. Um, they spotted it when I got the decorations down. So that was straight on the beds. Um, but other than that, yeah, we're starting from scratch. So I'm going to put the tree up, which is a six foot um, pre-lit tree. It is an absolute pain because it sheds absolutely everywhere. But I've had it for a very long time. So the, that is the first thing that I always do is get the tree up and then decorate it. All the decorations on the boys tree are red and white so I'm starting off with some tinsel which I got from Home Bargains I think. Some of it is new, some of it I've had for years but yeah I'm just going to alternate the colours and then I'm going to put in my tree picks which you might have seen in one of my Home Bargains hauls. I love these, I got four of these um, and then that like the candy theme so I'm just going to pop them at the top area of the tree. I also love these from Home Bargains, you might still be able to get some, the big sweets and then I've got candy canes as well and little smaller sweet decorations. They've really done amazing with all of the Candyland themed decorations this year. Home Bargains is definitely the place to go if you are looking for that sort of decoration, they just sell out really quickly. These also are from Home Bargains and I'm just placing them on the tree, I'm not actually attaching them with the string or anything, I'm literally just wedging them in. I'm then going to add all the ball balls. These are, none of them are new, they're just what I've had over the years. So again, all the reds and all the whites. I've also got lots of individual, more special decorations. None of them are expensive. What I tend to do is give the boys a decoration each every year and then that is added to the tree. So we've got little popcorn, which Toby loves, and um, an ice cream and a donut and things like that. Just really fun ones. Again, all from Home Bargains, I think. And yeah, I think they're really good little decorations, really cute. And I think all of them fit really nicely with the theme of this tree. Bye. Yes, it's a time of happiness, a time of joy But now this year is twice as special Cause I'm hoping for us to fall in love In this winter wonder My tree topper, again from Home Bargains, is a little elf hat Which is just the cutest thing um, So that is just getting plonked on the top of the tree Giving you a sign I can seem to look away and they're going to hang up the boys' stockings because Santa generally will put things in their stockings on Christmas Eve um, for them to open as soon as they wake up on Christmas Day and then we'll come downstairs for their main presents. But yeah, I'm putting their stockings on the wardrobe and then I'm just going to hang tinsel all around the bunk beds. I like to make a bit of a feature of the bunk beds. Um, you can see some baubles there that Archie is <laughs> wedged um, between the mattress because he was helping me decorate. But yeah, I think the bunk beds, because they take up so much of the room, that is what I, I do like to decorate that a lot. And I'm just going to go and hoover up some of the pine needles. I discovered that my shark wasn't really doing the job, so got Hetty um, on the job because when in doubt, obviously um, a Henry slash Hetty can get up anything. So I'm just getting up all of the little pine needles and then I'm going to add a tree skirt, which is new. 
This was from Home Bargains as well. I think it was five pound. And it's obviously just like a Santa belt theme. I've also got this train track. Now, I can't remember where this was from and some of it is missing at the back, but I'm gonna add some fake presents I do this every year, just wrap up some boxes and I'm just going to place them under the tree and then, yeah, the little train can go just at the front. So there's not a full track anymore, I don't know where some of it's gone. So it's just for display and you can't really tell, obviously, that there's a piece missing at the back if I do it that way. And then I'm just going to tidy up a little bit over here so that I can decorate this area of the room. I've got a few things that I've just had for a long time, the little Santa stop here, a few snow globes and things like that. This little garland is really cute, this was from Home Bargains, so I'm just going to put that on the boys' shelves. Next, this is one of my favourite decorations, this was from Home Bargains as well. I'm not sure if it's an outside decoration or not, it's like a waterproof material, but it's basically Santa's washing line. So I love sticking that up on the ceiling, and I've also got this, which I love, this fringe um, fake snow, Home Bargains and Amazon. I'm using rug tape actually to attach this to the bed. I always love the effect it has on the bunk beds. Obviously, if you've got double-sided tape, you use that, but I just had some rug tape, so that was why I thought I would attach it with that, which took me... A very short space of time, but I do think this makes a big difference on the bed. It just looks really cool, making it look like the bed's got loads of drippy snow. Yes, every time the snow is falling down and it is cold outside, we gather around the fireplace and no one cares about yesterday. My favorite holiday, it means so much more than words can say. And I'm also going to put some of it in the window. And then I also put some on the shelves. I am on my way. We'll put our differences aside and just enjoy this moment of peace and love and happiness. These balloons are ace. They are from Home Bargains and they are only a pound, I think. And I got a couple of candy canes and I got a big Santa face as well. So they're dead easy. You just get like the little tube that comes with them to blow them up. And it also comes with the ribbon as well. So I'm just pinning them to the ceiling so that they are just all hanging down. And now you're going to see a little before and after. So you've obviously just seen me doing a lot of this decorating and I've told you where a few things are from but I'll just go back over everything. All of this is from Amazon and Home Bargains, like the bigger longer one is from Home Bargains. All of my decorations pretty much are from Home Bargains again. Yeah, I think all of them. Even the tinsel is, I think the Christmas tree was, oh it's so old. It was the original Christmas tree actually when I first left home and bought my very own Christmas tree. This was the one that I used. It is a pain because it sheds like crazy but once I got a new Christmas tree this is why I've got a second one and obviously it just goes in the boys room it's a pre-lit one as well but yeah all of the decorations are from Home Bargains loads of fun sweets and tree picks and the tinsel as well I have put lots of snow all around put it over on the shelves as well 
I love this. I think it's supposed to be an outdoors decoration, but I find it works well in here because it's like waterproof fabric. So you're probably supposed to hang it up outside because it is washing as well, but I think it's fun in here. I like a nice big inexpensive decoration. I feel like it just makes a big difference to the room. The balloons have turned out great, only a pound each, so I'm really pleased with them. Yeah, really quick and easy to do as well. The boys' stockings, can't even remember where they were from, if I'm honest. Probably home bargains. You know me, everything's from home bargains. We've got Santa's magic key there as well. And yeah, I have just, um, I've added a decoration anywhere I can. I've taken the rug up as well because it just wasn't going very well like with everything and it was just an awkward shape once the tree's there um the tree skirt i'm happy with as well that was from home bargains of course the boys bedding that was already on the beds i think that white one was from home bargains and then the red one that dill's got was from i think it was amazon i've had that years i just um get them out at the start of start of december normally but obviously i'm doing everything a little bit earlier i've got a very annoying elf that i don't know if that'll if this still works actually oh i think the batteries have gone i think rudy's chewed its little hat as well but it normally sings a song i got them one of these each these little snow globes just from home bargains which is just you need a snow globe don't you at christmas underneath the tree i just wrap up boxes and i put these away i did these last year and then just put them away to use again this year they're just empty i had just remind the boys every time like they are empty they're just for show and then i've just put a few gift boxes under there as well that i already had and i'm yeah i'm really happy with it i think that they are going to love the finished result as well i've added a bit of organza just on these drawers which is actually a chair bow it's like a pack of two that you can get in home bargains. I got them a couple of years ago. I think they're really good for door bows as well. If you tie a few together, you can make a nice door bow with them. But yeah, that's the finished look. Let me know what you think. So there we are, another room, nice and festive. Um, I've got the rest of the decorations to show you and then I'm gonna do like, obviously I've done the tree and I've done the boys room and then I thought, I'll show you me decorating everywhere else and then do like a bit of a house, Christmas house tour with, along with it. So that's going to be coming up soon. I would love it if you gave this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed watching it. And I would love to see you again for my next one. Bye everyone.